हेलो गाइस वेलकम बैक टू आवर यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे वी आर डिवेलिंग इनटू द वर्ल्ड ऑफ फिल्ट्रेशन अ कॉमन एंड वाइटल प्रोसेस दैट अफेक्ट्स एवरीडे लाइफ्स इन वेरियस इंडस्ट्रीज फ्रॉम अंडरस्टैंडिंग व्हाट इज फिल्ट्रेशन टू इट्स टाइप्स प्रिंसिपल एप्लीकेशन वी हैव गॉट इट ऑल कवर्ड सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो इन द स्टार्टिंग ऑफ द वीडियो वी विल अंडरस्टैंड द बेसिक क्वेश्चन दैट व्हाट इज फिल्ट्रेशन इमेजिन फिल्ट्रेशन इज अ मेथड टू सेपरेट पार्टिकल्स और सब्सटेंसेस from a fluid beta liquid or gas this separation occurs by passing the fluid through a special medium that acts as a barrier it allows the fluid to pass through while trapping and retaining the particles or substances ensuring they don't continue with the fluid filtration is a essential technique for purifying liquids and gases removing the impurities and maintaining the quality across applications ranging from water and air purification to industrial process and healthcare so this was a basic definition of what is filtration so in brief filtration is a technique to separate the particles from the fluid by passing through a barrier where the substances or particles get retained on the barrier and the clear fluid passes through the barrier for better understanding think of it like using a sieve when cooking pasta the pasta stays in the sieve while the water passes through the sieves it's separating the pasta and the water with the help of sieves so this is a basic example of filtration now continuing our video with the types of filtration here we'll be discussing about three main types of filtrations from which the first is the mechanical filtration then the biological filtration and at last is the chemical filtration for the case of mechanical filtration this method of filtration uses physical barriers like screen or sand filters to trap the particles while in the case of biological filtration living organisms such as bacteria break down the contaminants which is typical in the process like water treatments at last in the chemical filtration it utilizes chemical reactions such as adsorption on activated carbon to remove the impurities from the fluid so this was a brief about the three types of filtration processes up next in this video we'll be looking at the filtration media where we'll be talking about the five types of filter media which is used worldwide from which the first and the most common filter media is sand this type of filter media is effective at removing larger particles making it common in pool filters and drinking water treatments another type of filter media is activated carbon this type of filter media is highly porous and chemically adsorptive it's used to trap the organic compound odor and some other chemical contaminants in water and air filtration then one another type of filter media is filter paper this is a porous material which captures particulates from liquid and gases and they are often used in laboratory filtrations the other type of filter media which is currently worldwide used and is used at a larger scale is membranes this type of filter media are thin selective barriers filtering the particles or molecules based on the size and they are widely employed in water purification and industries like pharmaceuticals and biotechnology and one of the simple type of filter media which is used is metal screens this type of filter media are mesh or perforated metals which are used in various industrial application to separate the particles by size so these were some of the most common and worldwide used filter media now moving on for this video we'll be looking at the principles of filtration now let's understand the fundamental principles of filtration so we'll be starting a discussion with size exclusion filters generally work by trapping particles based on their size smaller particles pass through it while the larger ones get caught on the filter media the next principle of filtration is depth filtration some filters have multiple layer that the particles must pass through similar to a sponge absorbing water capturing particles at different depths within the filter is done in filtration and another type of principle of filtration is surface filtration filters capture particles on the surfaces like a screen trapping the debris only particles that come in direct contact with the surface are removed now moving on to the most important discussion for this video that is the process of filtration so let's walk through the step by step filtration processes the filtration process starts with the inlet the contaminated fluid possibly with the particle or impurities enter the filtration system through a designated entry point 
then it comes in contact with the filter medium. The filter medium acts as the heart of the filtration process. It captures and retains the undesired particle allowing the clean fluid to pass through it. And at the end comes the outlet part. Once the fluid has transposed the filter media, the filtered clean fluid exits the system leaving behind the trapped particles and impurities. This process ensures that the fluid leaving the filtration system is cleaner and free from substances that were initially present, making it suitable for various applications such as water purification, air cleaning and industrial processes. Visualize this process as a simple animation or diagram showing the fluid flowing through the filter medium and emerging clean on the other side. So this was a simple process of filtration. Now as we all know, this concept of filtration has a worldwide application. So now let's explore the wide range of application of filtration across different industries. Filtration technique is normally used in water treatment, where filtration is critical in purifying the drinking water and treating the wastewater. It removes the impurities such as suspended solids, contaminants and ensures clean and safe water for consumption while reducing the environmental impacts. Another application is of air purification. The air purification relies on filtration to remove air pollutants, allergens and particulate matter, improving the indoor air quality and health. Then comes the next application which is pharmaceuticals. In pharmaceutical industries, filtration is essential for manufacturing medicines and vaccines, ensuring product purity, safety and sterility. And the last application for this video is food and beverages. Filtration plays a crucial role in food and beverage production clarifying and sterilizing the liquids, ensuring product stability and safety. In each of these applications, filtration is a fundamental process that guarantees safety, quality, purity in various fluids, impacting our daily lives in numerous ways. So guys, that's all for this video where we discussed about what is filtration, types of filtration, then some types of filter media, then we moved on to the principles of filtration followed by the filtration process and at the end we discussed about the application of filtration. So guys I hope you like this video and for more informative videos related to chemical engineering, process engineering, chemical safety, industrial safety, you can subscribe to this channel and guys feel free to ask any questions or comment down below. Thanks for watching and see you next video.